Cedric the Entertainer, and Regina Hall. They star in the new comedy Barbershop, The Next Cut. Things are changing. The Barbershop is now co-ed. Take a look. Who wants some non-profit gangster grub? All right, soul food to save fool's soul. Every delicious piece of beef helps keep a bullet off the street. I know that's right, because that who smoked your okra was popping in one fleek last time. There you go, Greg. Did, did she just say fleek? Don't, don't just make up words, right? There's a whole dictionary full of words. <laughs> that is so true. Would you please welcome back Cedric the Entertainer. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm telling you, loved it, loved it, lo loved the franchise. But this one, heart, humor, it has a story. And Eddie, your character, <laughs> yes. back again. And you have this comedic way about you, but you you keep it real. Yeah, you know, I think that uh, we wanted to, you know, it's been 12 years since the last one. So the opportunity to say something in this movie and at the same time be funny was important for uh, everybody that was coming back. And, of course, my character is, uh, he, he, he'd say it off the cuff. He'd say what he mean. And so, you know, I, I, Eddie's going to shoot it straight, man. Yeah, he, and he did. He did again. Yeah. Regina, I love the co-ed aspect of right, it. Right, because... it needed some ladies. Yeah, because you're the business partner mm -hmm. for for Calvin. Yes. And that just does add to the to the whole storyline. It does. I mean, you know, I think it makes Calvin, he's more grown up. He's got someone else to be accountable to, mm -hmm. you know, in terms of business. And then this one, you know, he's got someone to be accountable to. You know, <laughs> as, as much as you can make Eddie accountable. I know. You just look at him and you start. Because <laughs> you said what was left on the cutting room floor. Oh, my goodness. I laughed. So much every day. I mean, Cedric. It's and you know what's crazy about it? As soon, as soon as it comes on, like as soon when he comes out of makeup, Eddie just yeah. comes out. It's not even. It's so organic. It's amazing. To yeah. Watch. Well, you, I, like once you turn into Eddie, it's no telling what I will say, even as a character. <laughs> it's just like, it's like you know what? I can just talk about anything. <laughs> I talk about anything in the bum shop right here. The dress, the boot, all these boots these girls wearing. Here. <laughs> Why you got boots on? It's Get a pedicure. See, <laughs> I was spoken and wrong. Uh -huh. Iron and arm. Uh, uh, so I'll uh, never get it. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it is, it's, and that's the thing. When I was when I was sitting there and I was watching it the other night, and I knew that I was going to laugh, and I cried too. Yeah. But I just didn't realize that I was going to come away thinking and going, huh? Mm. And that's that's hard to do sometimes to combine the humor with yeah. a message, isn't it, Regina? Absolutely. I mean, I think well, I think Malcolm is great at that, and I think what's so important is that for this movie to have been set in Chicago, and to have the backdrop of what's really happening in the Chicago, the to Chicago combine so that with having these men and these black men and fatherhood, and and then to show what a community can do collectively, the difference that it can make. It, I, I felt like it was inspiring and thought provoking. Yeah. Well, you both you both are, and you always are into so many different things. I mean, I love King of Comedy. I mean, you guys, are, you you just really rule like that. So, what would Eddie? How would Eddie mentor <laughs> some young youngins that are coming up in the comedic world? You know, first of all, I, I, I want to tell you, do your own jokes. Don't be going around doing Rich Pry jokes. <laughs> Rich they don't Pry. even know who Rich Pry is. They don't think about the young folks. Everybody want to be Kevin Hart. <laughs> but be, do your own joke. All right? That's what I say. That's, that's what Henry would say. First thing first. 15th anniversary for Scary Movie. I what? know. Oh. I was 15 when I shot it. <laughs> so yeah, I was a child. So <laughs> you and Anna, you guys just love make, Anna. It, yeah, just make yeah. it work. Yeah, I love Anna. We want to do something together now. Oh, Again, really? Yeah, we are. We're trying to figure out what I, what what what's going to be our project now that we're 29. <laughs> <I know>. <laughs> <laughs> she, <laughs> Her eyes so expressive. Um. Thank you both very much. And you've got to stay through the credits of this movie, Barbershop, yes. The oh. Next Cut. I don't want to do any spoilers here. Is in theaters coming up on Friday. Thank you both so much.